the importance of fertility in grassland management in any sport is that you have a base to work from and to start you need to have a soil sample taken from all of the farm so as that you can put a plan in place on how you can get to having all of your land at the correct Lyme, P and K indexes. In Ireland we see from Chagas results that 60 to 70 percent of dairy herds have suboptimal Lyme, P and K results and as a result of that they're growing less grass. Take for instance on Lyme, you need an application of Lyme by two tonne to the acre, you'll increase your grass growth by a tonne and a half. An extra tonne and a half of grass will carry more cows than that's worth. But too, too many people in this country think that reseeding is going to solve everything for them. If you don't have your Lyme P and K right before you start reseeding, it's pointless reseeding. We need to get the basics right and then in a new swart we need to have your Lyme P and K indexes identified before you start and then when we reseed the new swart we need to monitor these in the new swart because a reseeding program is over 10 years and if we don't keep the Lyme P and K right we'll have weed grasses coming into those swarts over the coming four to five years and it'll exacerbate the cost of reseeding because you'll be back in there after five six years because the sward will not last. A lot of this weed control is also important in new grasses because if you don't spray off before you reseed you won't kill off the weeds that are in the old sward and you'll have those coming through into your new swards. So an important point on reseeding is use a full rate of glyphosate to get a good kill before you reseed. Give it, allow it two weeks to three weeks to burn off that old sward and do away with the old sod before you reseed. And then the real important part is once you reseed your swart that when you get the new grass coming after five, six weeks, you need to go in there with a product that will take out all of the weeds that are in the swart. And if you hit the weeds at that stage, they're very easy to kill. You have little seedling docks that are no greater than the size of a 2p kind. And you need to spray that early. If you leave it go to 10, 12, 14 weeks, it's a lot harder to kill. And the products you need to choose from are clover safe products if you have clover in the swart or products that will kill the clover. If you are using a clover safe product, they're not as effective on weed control when you get larger weeds. So the idea there is you need to get in when the weeds are only five or six weeks, really small, as I said, the size of a two euro kind or a two p kind, and that will kill all those weeds at that stage. And that is probably the most important part of the whole reseeding program. Okay Paddy, you can pick it up there if you like.